Okay. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm, is it, I'm, I'm at the same place at this farm here. Um, I actually don't know what the name of the farm is, but by tomorrow, the owner of the farm is going to tell me what the name is. Um, we are planting seed on this sub um, section of the land. Yeah, and these other guys are here. Now, in, in working with this, uh, with all these guys, eh? if you, you're going to find a way of negotiating with them, if you negotiate with them on bags, that bags that they should plant the bag. I'm sure to tell you they will plant out they they can plant 100 kg in 50 by 100. <laughs> if you tell them that they should plant bags, you price it with them on bags. Uh, they are going to heap everything that in one land and tell you that oh, God, the bag don't finish. Give me their give me give give us our money, maybe they go. Yeah, so you're going to negotiate with them in a way that. That will be advantageous to you uh, because we just said uh, they just plant this one bag all that bag will finish in one place they'll pour everything in one place at the end you won't get positive results for your um for your money you get value for your money so we are still here <laughs> permit me i gotta cover my face because of sun that one is planting and covering um they're planting and covering the land is big uh they use bulldozer to finish all this area then those other guys are going to use hand they're already using hand to bush out that top that grasses you see at that top they're using hand clearing to clear all those areas this is animal paradise we are planting bacteria for a new goat farm because they gotta eat the goats gotta eat so we are planting grass for them for them at this place i want to walk around let me walk around the farm um i think uh, there is a grad there that's a pen that's a pen there they are building the pen there just give me one minute uh i want to pull my shoe something entered into my shoe let me dust it out okay yeah Okay, here we go. That's more small. We are not I this robot since So we have a new goat pen here. <laughs> it's coming up. It's coming up. It's coming up. It's because of the coming goats that we are planting those grasses. Are planting the grasses because of the common goats the goats are coming this uh, um, dry season this farm will be stocking and then we're almost at the dry season now okay it's going the land is going that way that way that way that way that way that way inside that way there's the goat pen it's still in building it's coming up um okay that bushy part i think the owner is saying that that bushy part we're going to use chain link to fence that bushy part there's a bushy part up there from where the bulldozer walk up to down down upward while this other area that the bulldoze they're going to use block to fence it yeah they're already working with the block that's the block work to fence this other area that the bulldozer bulldoze in plus where we're planting the grasses Plus this pain and all this area. I think that's a machine here. Modern block. Uh -huh. So at this point, I want to say um, goat farming is most lucrative, a very lucrative business. You're going to make your money back, but um, the people trying to enter into it should not just think that you can use one dollar to invest in a business and make one million dollars, or because you want to do a business where you will make one million dollars. You just think that you should, um, you should invest one one dollar. Uh, because most people like goat farming. When you begin to tell them that this is what to cost, this is what to cost, they begin to think it's a little bit uh, frightening. It's a little bit frightening. These are bricks, bricks they want to use to fence. They are still molding. They have materials. They are molding. From what you can see, you see that it is not um, um, child's play. It's not child's play. 
Have you seen it? The bulldozer, bulldozer, this part of the, the, the land, we're going to fence it to block. That's money to bring bulldozer and bring a, a, a low bed. There's a vehicle that used to carry the bulldozer to, from where it is down to here. That one is called low bed. Then you can pay for the bulldozer and then you start molding blocks or even building pen. Have you seen it? Yeah, so most people, when you tell them, they're like, ah, it's too expensive, it's too expensive, it's too expensive. You're going to get your money back. It's an investment. You're putting your money into it. These are poles. These are poles. These are chain link. These are chain link that are going to use. I seen it. It's not small money. I seen it. I think we came, we brought this one yesterday night at about 9, 8, 9 p.m. in the night. All the way from um, Edo State down to this bush. Uh, this place is somewhere around the Ogun State. We brought these ones from Edo State down here yesterday. And then they are walking. They are walking. They are walking. If you can see up there, up there, where's my fingers? Okay. Somewhere around this area, yeah, you see some guys are there clearing. The immediately after the pen, you see those other guys are planting the seed. And then here you see these guys are walking. They are walking. Ogafa. That's the bricklayer guy. They are building the workers' quarters. Uh, I think they have about three. How many rooms are there now? Four rooms. Okay. Four rooms. All right. Uh, four rooms, kitchen, toilet, and bathroom. Okay, what are you building? <laughs> four rooms, I mean three rooms, kitchen, toilet, and bathroom. Three rooms. Three rooms. This is a store. Office. Office, uh, office three, okay. Three okay, this is office. This is room. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then this is what? A room again? Room, room. Toilet and kitchen. Toilet and kitchen, okay. Room. Okay, my, my Yasi Meji, are we? Toilet, okay. Yeah. Okay. Then that's another small room again. Yes. Or a store. Yes. Why did they dig this hole? What is there? Mm, well. Well, okay. Where is suck away? They have not done that one. Okay. So you see, they actually, um, okay. Okay. You see the foundations for the parameters. It's already being built. Yeah, this is the foundation for the fence. Yeah, this is the foundation for the fence. It's already being built. This is a goat farm. A goat farm. The owner is planning to build a goat farm. Or, no, 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 it's not planning. He's building a goat farm. When my phone will go for inside, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, this is a well. Amen. Let me video it is well. Hmm. Okay. <sighs> so, like I was saying at the beginning, you see how much this person is investing in these projects. And some other people want to do the same projects, but they want to spend 50 kobo. And sometimes when you are you want to do something, uh, just prepare and do it well. Sadi, what do you mean? Window mower. Okay. So the door will face inside. Okay. So it's not a small project, actually. It's not a small project. You see, the workers' quarters is going on. This farm is going to stock by December, actually. <laughs> That's why we are. We are, we are, uh, I don't want to use the word rush. We are putting our hands to work and we are not rushing. There's going to be time before the ending of October. Everything, everything here is going to be ready. Everything is going to be ready by October ending. I seen it. This house will be ready. The zinc to roof this house is already there. It's already there. The zinc to also roof that, that pen is already there. And so it's just for them to, to speed up and then to get it done. When you're doing goat farming, the bigger the land, the better it is. Um, there are different levels, different levels of goat farming. You can start small, but aim at something like this. Yeah, start small. Don't say, ah, because I don't have big money, I can't start. You can start, actually. You can start. But aim big. 
don't just say you want to do it and then um um begin to do some kind of a below standard below standard structure below standard uh, moves when you do those below standard moves you're going to end up doing one thing two times you're going to come back to do it again and sometimes when you want to build your pen let your pen be standard because you're going to standard means you can use block to build a standard pen you can use wood to build a standard pen you can use wood to build a standard pen i seen it uh, but don't go and do something wood wood has different measurements i think there is two by four two by three two by two don't go and use a you say this below standard uh, material if you do that one day you see all these forests there are no all this bush there is no house here there's no house here see the trees are cleared away when this the storm we experience in this area is different from the storm you experience in the city when there are story buildings that is is, is weakening the storm in this kind of area, there is nothing to weaken the storm. When the storm comes, it comes. When it hits, it hits. And don't want to build a pen whereby you are sleeping in your house one day, storm, remove the roof and use it to baptize or use it, you, you, use it to, to, to bury all your goods. And just because you don't want to spend money, you don't want to spend money, you begin to buy things that are not up to standard. It, it, will, it, will, it, will, it will be so expensive at the long run. I see it will be very, very expensive because if the if if storm um pull down your, your pen, some goats may die. The pen will fall on the goats, some may die, even though some some of them don't if they are, if maybe they didn't hit them and then they didn't die, you will come back again to build what you have built before, which is doing one thing two times. Are you seeing it? Just strategize. I think I've said it many times and I'm still saying it again. Uh, I think in some of our seminars, goat farming is not a business. It's an investment. It's an investment. It's something you put in money, you allow it to grow. And then um, you can't just do goat farming as the only thing you are doing. Maybe you do, you, you're you looking for a business to start. You know, so you want to start goat farming. It's not going to bring returns back um, in, in one year, two years. It's not going to bring much return back one year, two years. So you're going to have to do have a life, do something, have the business you are doing, the things you are doing already to pay your bills before you now say, okay, I want to invest into goat farming. Uh, but there are, there's an aspect of goat, the goat system that you can do as business. You can actually go to an area where goat is cheap and buy and come and sell at the areas where goat is not so cheap. Uh, not so cheap. Are you seeing it? Uh, you, that's goat business. You buy within two weeks, you sell it. Or you buy within 10 days, you sell it. You make your small profits. And uh, that is goat business. But goat farming is not a business. There is a business part of it at the end when you are selling. But before you get to that point, it's going to take you like two, three years before you say, okay, I want to start selling. And then before you even start selling, you have to have a high number. If you have less than 100 goats, you are not qualified to start selling. Because um, how much do you want to sell? If one person comes to buy 20 from you, only five people will just finish your farm. Only five people will just buy all the goats you have and your farm is finished. Some of those people who sell goats in the market, um, they carry vehicle, they fill that vehicle. Every vehicle have a capacity, maybe 50, maybe 25. So if you have a goat farm of 100 pieces and four people come to buy 25, 25, your goat farm is finished. Are you saying it's, it's empty? Even though you say you want to sell to breeders, an, an average breeder will buy 50 goats at one time. So if two people come to buy 50, 50, <laughs> you the goat farmer, you'll be having zero. <laughs> zero so it is not a business it is an investment it's safe of keeping some millions of naira in the fa in the in the bank put it in goat farming i'm just saying in one place i'm supposed to be showing everywhere <laughs> uh, so these are chain link yeah you fence your farm the reason why you fence your farm is for your animals to be going out and be grazing you see that grasses we are planting when, once they grow, the animals will come out in the morning and go and eat up. They will eat to satisfaction. Because goats used to pick food. They used to pick what they like. And they will pick and they will eat. They will pick, they will eat what they like and they will come back, they will sleep. It's better that way than putting them in one place and bringing things you like for them. Um, it, it's zero grazing, but it's not so so good. Let the animals go out, let them go free. If you are if you are starting with that, no problem. No problem at all. Start with that, no problem. But after some time, plan to give them imagine imagine this place let me let me go to the beginning 
from this area now. Look, 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 look. Can't go graze in this area? Can they go out? All those places you are seeing uphill. Uphill. You see it? These grasses you're seeing uphill now. All these bam, 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 palm trees you're seeing. Degraded area. I think it's like half of the major land. Degraded area is like half of the major land. Are you seeing it? The, these grasses you're seeing behind it. That's where the land stop. You go far inside. If you take this road, you take this road down to the ending. They see a big space that they are going to clear. They are already clearing it. Animals, goats, cows, they can actually graze. They can walk around and they can graze and be free. And when they are free, when they are grazing freely, they will be growing fast. Fast. So, this is animal paradise. I'm just going around going around showing what people are doing as goat farming. Are you seeing it? So don't just think that you want to do goat farming, um, you just keep like a um, hundred naira to start goat farming and then you want to make a hundred million. <laughs> don't, don't, don't dream like that. That dream, that dream has a, has a error. <laughs> has a error. Uh, swear money, and get quality standard spend money get quality get standard do things do things in the right way if you do things in the right way most times you will not have regrets you will not make mistakes are you seeing it like i say sometimes when we are younger we use wisdom but now that we're getting older we do what is right and just check out how much it will cost and do it and don't try to cut corners don't try to be smart all those cutting corners is going to reduce you, return you back to the beginning. And those cutting corners at the end, <laughs> it's not going to work. So just do what's right. Calculate how much it's going to cost. All this land I'm passing is grazing area for the go. Not even grazing area. See, they have dug, they've dug the, the, the foundations for the fence. Is it foundations? Ha! Huh. I can't trek it around because it's a, it's a kind of a hill. If you can look... If you can look you will see you see the foundations are going and it's going i cannot track it around it's a hill the foundation is going cutting through that region down 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 cutting out to cover where this place you see they're going to fence all those areas with brick and then the, there's a, a machine there molding block sand and granite is mixed together mixed together to make block and then they start setting it I seen it so this place is big enough for them to graze. I seen it. My video is gonna be more than 40 minutes, but I think I I just gotta do it. It's gonna be very lengthy, or maybe I should pause this last one. Um make it into two videos instead of making one video of more, more than one hour. I seen it so this is the pain. Strategize and do what is right. Just do what will, um, do what is right. I think the video on my voice is skipping. Maybe my voice may not follow the video, but I don't know why it's skipping like that. But anyhow, so just strategize, do what is right. Here's the pen. I think I'm going to make a follow-up video after they, they cover the roof. I went inside the pen to video so that I can make, um, can show well. I've seen it, so that I can show well. So that's that's it. That's it. That's it. Ah. It's not easy oh. <laughs> to be trekking trekking around this this place. <laughs> I've gone up and I've come down, I'm climbing up again. <laughs> it's not easy. Oh. <laughs> so don't 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 laugh at me. <laughs> That's a roofing sheet they want to use. The roofing sheet is already there for this one and also for that one. The chain link materials are there. That's the one I brought yesterday night. I brought them. The blocks are here. They are molding. They are strategizing. Everything will be ready before November. November animals are coming. So when you want to do your goat farming, I'm not saying do as big as this. But I'm saying just do what is um 
follow the standard. Yeah, follow the standard. Follow the standard. If you're doing a small one, follow the standard. If you're doing a big one, follow the standard. Hey. Follow the standard. Whatsoever you want to do, do something that will not um, fall or crumble. And then you have to come and um, um, start again. If you build a good pen and collapse, you start again. Uh, if it collapse, it again. You need to do what is right. And do what is right. Do what is up to standard. Then you will have um, value for your money. You have value for your money. This is Animal Paradise. I think I'm going to end this video now. I wanted to make a short video to add it to the other ones I made. But I'm going to separate them. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, Animal Paradise page on Facebook, Animal Paradise Farm. We have Animal Paradise, Animal Farmers Association on Facebook. We have different subgroup. If you want to join any call, some are free, some are, uh, some are free, some are paid. Anyone you want to join is your choice. Thank you very much again. Bye-bye.